Hi, and welcome back, beautiful collectives. Thanks so much again, guys. I appreciate each and every one of you for all your comments, your likes, your subscriptions. Just know that I truly mean that. I'm really interested to find out why this person is so worried about this retaliation of the karmic. Why is this person so afraid of the karmic retaliation? Hmm. Ah, because they know damn well that they're toxic. That's why. <clears throat> the Samper is remaining silent here. Because they're doing a lot of drinking. I don't know. This karmic could have like what's this karmic doing? Why? They're trying to remain strong. It's like this karmic it is to do with you. Trying to protect their money. Something to do with they're protecting the past person. They're working on some type of plan or arrangement. What's this? Hmm. Something to do with payouts. Something to do with um, payouts. Mm -hmm. It's something to do with stealing or lying. Fear that this person is going to do something to... Yeah, they're delusional. This person is afraid that this karmic will come against you somehow. They're delusional. This person is saying they could have drug addictions or that they're somehow not in their right mind. They're afraid that this person is going to come toward you with some kind of fear, instill fear in you somehow. They're lying. Yeah, they're afraid that this person is going to um, affect how you feel about them. <clears throat> affect your success somehow publicly now
they're saying that this karmic thinks that they are your uh, they are the soul mate okay this karmic they're worried that this karmic is going to talk to you and distort and confuse you they're waiting they're holding back and they are ghosted they feel foolish for hurting their soul mate but this karmic energy they're afraid that this karmic is going to come toward you and hurt you in some form of fashion confuse you that's what their worry is they're in love with you it's something to do with uh call you or talk to you or somehow uh they're guided They've decided to walk away and end things, but they're afraid that this person is going to do something to affect you somehow. Yeah, that they'll come toward you and cause you to mistrust them. They want to, they're afraid that this karmic is going to come toward you and affect you somehow. Maybe damage your reputation or bring you a bunch of burdens. That's what they're afraid of. They are stalking you from a distance. Because they have ended something with the karmic, the karmic is spying on them watching their every move from a distance and they're afraid that this karmic is going to harm you yes they are yes maybe this karmic has threatened to beat your ass or something like that and it's like, I'm going to beat the shit out of the collective, something like that. And they're afraid that this person, because they are being watched by the karmic, they're afraid that this person is going to come toward you and hurt you. That's why they're not coming back around. It's like they are, yeah, because the karmic is jealous and envious. And is they're afraid that this karmic is going to... Ten of Swords, you. Yeah. <laughs> They're not rational. They're not rational. Yeah, that's why this person is weighing something out before they communicate. They want to tell you the truth. They want to tell you that they love you. But they're afraid of retaliation. I'm telling you right now that they are because they've ended something with the karmic they're afraid of retaliation against you because they could be going they're mad because they could be taking this karmic to court and this is it's about a house and they're like it's about finances They want to offer you a commitment and I think and they want to work on things. But this, uh, yeah, secrets. They're afraid that this karmic is going to lie and deceive you, come toward you and lie to you. That's the truth. I think that they want to apologize you make them happy they're in love with you they see the ten of cups with you they're passionate about you they want to share some kind of good news toward the temperance angel they see your worth but they're thinking that you're going to reject them because of whatever has gone on, whatever they have done with this karmic, all their dirty little secrets, you know what I'm saying? 
this karmic is threatening to reveal and they know whatever dirty little secrets that this person has done that this karmic is going to report to you and turn you against them. Some of them are lies. <laughs> Some of them are the truths. <clears throat> and they're thinking you're going to reject them if they come toward you now the way things are. That you will reject them because this karmic is threatening uh, to destroy you, <laughs> basically. What's going on? What did this karmic say? What did this karmic tell this person? Yeah, what'd they say? I'd like to know what this karmic is planning to do toward the collective. They know that this person wants to come back around to you and work on things and they are going to stay alone for a while. They're afraid of a tower. With this karmic energy, they're healing from this karmic. Something about the public, you know what I mean? It's like threatening them somehow. This other lover. That's what they're afraid of. Yep. Paying for legal advice here. Did something risky with their money and it's like at a distance. So this karma got crap on them. That's why they're staying silent. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah, they're scared that this person is going to hire somebody to hit you. I don't know. They're scared for you. They're afraid this karmic will attack you somehow. Yes, they are. That's the truth. They're going to court over something financial. They're trying to, they are afraid of retaliation. I'm telling you right now, they are. They're working on a plan. They see the happiness with you. They have true love on their mind. They're working on a plan. So it's almost as if they're emotional. Drama. 
something to do with a friend and hurt hurt hurtful words toward you they're afraid because they know they're going to be bringing drama toward you they see the ten of cups with you they see marriage with you reconciling with you they find you very attractive beautiful but they're scared this king of wands is afraid of this heavy burdens they're trying to avoid some kind of sadness in the future because they're ending something, they want to trans. What? Emperor looking at ending something with a spouse. And they're scared because this karmic energy is planning to retaliate. It's got them in fear, they don't trust them. They're afraid of what they're going to do toward the temperance angel. It is what has ever happened, whatever friends got involved, whatever person got involved in your situation. They believe the rumors, the lies, the gossip, the deception. And it's like, how do they tell you that they believed everyone over you and they're afraid that if they come toward you and communicate with you this karmic will retaliate because they got shit on this person yes it is something about um They're delusional. They are delusional. Because they have been something to do with as above, so below. So they're staying silent. Because this person who they're dealing with is delusional they can't trust them they're not trustworthy they don't know what this person is capable of doing and if they were coming toward you they know it's going to bring you a bunch of drama that's the truth they know that this person will hurt you Because they're very selfish. They're a karmic. That's the karmic wheel. You know what I mean? They're watching their every move. They're not rational. They're not in their right mind. This karmic is off balance. And they, they're watching this person. They're leaving this person. And headed toward... They want to keep this karmic calm because they're a loose cannon. They're afraid that this person will tell you a bunch of lies and they will never get a, they know they only got a one shot deal here. And they're scared at this moment because not only did they do you dirty, but whoever they were dealing with, they know this person, maybe they were pillow talking, you know, and, and now this person is going to use that information to use against you to somehow ruin your success. It's all a bunch of shit. So the karmic basically has got this person in fear of making any move 
and they got to watch what they're doing because they are afraid of retaliation. This karmic is not in their right mind. They're saying they're delusional. They are unstable, emotionally unstable. And they don't know how this karmic is going to react. There's something to do with going to court and a bunch of finances and legalities that are involved. And it's almost like this person is afraid to talk to you or come toward you because they're afraid of the repercussions. They're afraid of what it's going to bring around to you. Slander, ruin you somehow. This karmic is capable of anything because they are not rational. And it's like they're worried that this karmic is going to repeat information. Some of it is accurate. Some of it is inaccurate. But they know they only got a one-shot deal with you. At least that's how they're viewing it. And they know that if they come towards you, it's going to create nothing but drama in your life. And especially if you're in the public eye, this one is threatening to ruin your reputation, slander you, come against whatever good thing you got going on, your finances. Especially if you're in the public eye. <laughs> They're threatening to retaliate. That's why they're not coming toward you. Maybe this karmic has threatened to attack, hire a lawyer and attack your finances. Or, you know, it's all threats, threats, threats. So actually this person is trying to protect you without you knowing it. Take care.